Coach Jackson. Coach Jackson. Coach Jackson. Yeah, I got a question over here. Hold on. All right. I got to get to All right. Oh. <laughs> All right. Before we uh, begin, I just want to say, due to Kobe Bryant's legal problems, uh, he may miss some games this season. How many, I don't know. Uh, so, yeah. uh, Coach Jackson, are you saying that Kobe could miss the playoffs? It's possible, yes. Coach, yeah. how can you make sure your other players don't end up in a situation like Kobe is in now? Well, uh, today, actually, we signed a player who I'm 100% sure is not going to have the same problems that Kobe had. So, uh, <laughs> without further ado, I'd like to introduce you to the newest Laker and Kobe's replacement, Saffron Johnson. Saffron. <laughs> Hi, you guys. Okay, right off the bat, I just want to say that I am so psyched to be playing b-ball with the Lakers. <laughs> I've already been to a fitting, as you can see, and I'm looking forward to throwing the b-ball at the scoring area and bouncing it. <laughs> that's, uh, that's dribbling. Dribbling, dribbling. Oh, yeah. Sure, cute, yes. Okay. Also, I plan to grab all of the missed throws. It's, uh, it's rebounds. Yes. Rebounds. Perfect. Rebounds. Yeah. yeah, like catch you on the rebound. Yeah, I get it. Okay. Also, I think that my best thing is going to be b-ball throws from long distances. Okay? Unless somebody's all up in my grill and then it's like, hello, a little space, please. <laughs> But mainly, I plan to hand it to the Shaxter so he can make his hard slam-bam basketball shot. Uh, so no worries. So, Saffron, do you have any basketball background? Sure. I went to Sarah Lawrence College, where I was an extra on the b-ball team uh, my freshman year. Then I took a year abroad to study graphic design. And when I got back, I was like, whatever, as far as b-ball is concerned. But, you know, to tell you the truth, I did, I did miss the pageantry and the whole hurly-burly ruckusness of it all. Uh, he, he did play college ball, you know. Uh, Saffron, they should have... Tell them your stats. Yeah, uh, I had a 29-inch waist. <laughs> Not those stats. No, honestly, I have gained some weight in the 15 years since college, but who hasn't, right? So I'm doing the whole Atkins thing just to keep that trimness, mainly. But I do miss my carbs, let me tell you. I do miss my carbs. <laughs> Okay, so I'm under a lot of pressure, right? Because of the Kobe rape thing, okay? So I figured, you know, pick up a gay guy. He's not going to be a problem with the ladies. It seemed like a good idea at the time. Um, so, Saffron, you're about 35 years old? Ugh, don't remind me. <laughs> and you're not all that tall, are you? I'm 5'8 in heels. Uh... Uh, Coach Jackson, can I ask how much the 35-year-old, 5'8 gay Laker is getting paid? Ooh, I know that one. We don't need to go into details. 30 about, uh... mil a year. All right, I freaked out, okay? I panicked. Um, Coach, is this, the, is this the dumbest thing you've ever done? This is the dumbest thing anybody's ever done. You know, uh, the only thing I've done that is kind of like that is, uh, I was high at a party one time, and I... I stuck my penis in a light socket. Oops, been there, done that, girlfriend. Oop, tickle, don't hit. <laughs> so. Oh, man. Does anyone have any pot I could buy? Oh, the bouncer at the manhole has some great weed. Oh, and if we leave now, we can be there by happy hour. That's half price Cosmos and baby backdoor ribs. Sounds great, but you're buying. If you're selling, <laughs> sailor. So I'll, I'll see you later. I'll just hang here. Fill up. No, I can't. I gotta go. Fill up. I wish I could. Fill up. All right, let's go. 